Hello guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Vanessa, you can call me Nessa and today I have a little haul and of course it's makeup and it's from Target. Um, it's been a while I don't go to Target so I went to the beauty aisle as soon as I get inside the store and I find some nice things that I never tried before, brand names that I didn't even know exist and um, yeah they were all in sale except for one item. So right now I have right next to me is this brand name called Undone Beauty. I never heard from it, but it's a basically an own foundation matte tint, kind of like a foundation tint and moisturizer type of thing. It says that it's a light coverage, vegan, cruelty free, and it has coconut oil, no, coconut extract for the uh, glowy one and tea tree oil for blemishes and oil control for the uh, matte one. These ones were less than $5 on sale. So I grabbed both and they both look about the same on the skin. Actually, it kind of give me kind of like a, oops, <laughs> give me a little of a, I don't know, white cast, I would say. This is the matte version supposedly, right? So now it's wet, so it has that shine in it. And let me show you right next to it, the, um, glowy version so that's the one it's now runny and for me they look about the same they look the same right now I'm gonna I don't know I when I spread it on my face and I apply half uh, one side matte and the other side was the uh, glowy one I really didn't see any difference and actually it was a very, a very uh, white cast, and I didn't like it. I don't know on the um, on the packaging. It looks very yellow. You know, I like that the matte has a matte packaging, and the more glowy has the more shiny packaging. And the little squeeze bottle, so I like that, so you can get the product all pretty easy. But so far, I, this is a no-no for me. It's sad because. You know, uh, it wasn't that much, but you know, another uh, tinted moisturizer, and this one has uh, 30 FPF, and it says it's for 40 minutes water resistant. This is this brand name, Set Moi, <laughs> and it's very nice. It's like a very much a tinted moisturizer very nice and glowy on the skin in my opinion it's very nice and it spreads very easy on the skin i apply it and i do like it a lot and of course it it has 30 fbf so you have to always put some sun cream in your skin underneath still but this is a plus for me another one that i find it's from uh so number seven and I never own anything number seven that I can remember. This is a Protect and Perfect Advanced All-in-One Foundation, Hydrating, Age Defining, Medium Coverage, and it has a SPF 50. This one reminds me that it's Cosmetics. The consistency, it's not as thick as the It's Cosmetics in my opinion, but it's very dewy, very nice on the skin. I really, really like it. And of course, 50 SPF. Wow, it's a win for me. That's another one. And the last one would be the uh, number seven as well. It's a foundation. This one is the Lift and Illuminated Triple Action Serum Foundation SPF 15, suitable for sensitive skin. This one is a more neutral. And it's not running at all. And that's what I'm wearing on my skin right now. It lifts you, it lifts a nice um, dewy finish on the skin. I set it with powder, but my lord, it's amazing. I really like it. So far, uh, all the products for the face, I like most of them, except for those undone on foundation. I didn't like it at all, honestly. And then I have a how is it called? NYX Born to Glow. This is a radiant concealer. I really like it. It's a very yellow undertone like my skin. 
it has the little poofy thing on the end i'm not sure i can probably pull that out that's what i'm wearing under my eyes i like it i really like it i really like it and um but i had to test these products better like i'm gonna probably do a video for each one especially for the ones that i like <laughs> so far my first impression would be most of them are good except for those first two so far i don't know if i can make them work i would try you know um so also i have some products for the eyebrows for the um billion dollar beauty i have two items from the company where's the other one right here and this is those brow powders okay i use both of them um they were $1.99 so i grabbed them never heard from this company but uh, they have all the makeup on sale so that's one of the things that they have left and there was not much um also two blushes very pretty blushes those are the ones that i'm wearing on my skin i really recommend it two dollars come on but you need a, a palette to put them on and uh yeah so the last item i have it is this um, you, you see it on my eyes it's a beautiful palette from elio girl and this is how it looks like you see this guys oh my gosh so pretty i had to use a glitter glue but i felt like from time to time I'm gonna have to probably fix it because um i don't think this is gonna be a long lasting so far i had this makeup for a few hours and i had to actually fix the um the eyeshadows but this is beautiful these two oh my gosh they're amazing they are amazing let me show you pretty quick swatches they are very pigmented they are very pigmented so i just tap a little bit but they're very pretty i mean um yeah so that's it that's all i find and on sale from target um and if you know interested to see me uh doing some videos with those makeup like i wear tests on all of them so let me know comment down below follow me follow my instagram please and god bless you guys thank you for watching thank you for your time and yeah have a nice beautiful day or night whatever you are right now and you know drink your water drink a lot of water you know please keep yourself as healthy you can you know do whatever you have to do to you know do your best okay and stay safe and behave <laughs> thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in another video Bye bye